Hey guys, so today we are going to make tamales. Making tamales is a tradition during Christmas time in Mexico. And I decided that I wanted to make the vegan healthy version of it. They're very easy to make, they're super delicious, they're great for this time of year to share. I have corn tamales and rice tamales. Before we get started with the video recipe, I'm gonna ask a huge, huge favor of you guys. If you guys can please like my video, if you guys like the content in my channel, because YouTube changed something in their algorithm, them and and since you guys are subscribed to my channel those videos are not gonna be coming up in your homepage so liking my videos helps me so so much thank you guys so much thank you thank you thank you too much talking how about we get started with the recipe ready let's do this the first step is making our cashew cheese and for this you're gonna need one cup of cashews previously soaked in water the juice of half a lime or lemon and one fourth cup of water you're gonna put all of this in the blender you're gonna blend it all really well and now we have our substitute for butter and now for our corn tamales you're gonna need about four ears of white corn you're gonna put this in the food processor process it really really well and for the inside of our tamales, we are going to use some slices of chile poblano, which is a green chile. It's like a Mexican chili, but you can use bell peppers if you don't find these. First, I'm gonna put it on fire so that I can peel off the skin and it'll be just more edible and more easily digested by the body. Once that's done, you're gonna put it in a plastic bag. You're gonna tie it up so that the skin becomes easier to take off. You take off the skin and then you just slice it into thin, slices like so then in a pan you put your slices of your chiles you put around two tablespoons of the cashew cheese and you're gonna mix it really well and now it's time to make our tamales for the tamales you're gonna need some tamale sheets you can find these in the store, just ask for them. And I previously soaked these in water so that they're easier to manage. You're gonna put two scoops of our processed corn, then a little bit of some chiles with the cashew cream cheese. And then you're gonna fold it either to the right or to the left. You wanna fold it so that it goes under the corn. And then you're gonna fold it the other way and then you're gonna fold it forward. Then you're gonna take a small piece of one of the tamale sheets and you are going to tie a double knot around it. You can make as many tamales as you want. As you can see, I'm making mine tiny and cute, <laughs> but you can make yours bigger if you want. Now we're gonna make another version of tamales, which is gonna be rice tamales. And for this, you're gonna need one cup of brown rice and one cup of white rice. You can use only brown rice or only white rice, however you want. I'm gonna use both to see how they come out. And for the inside of these tamales, I'm gonna stuff them with some bell peppers and the cashew cheese so in another pan you're gonna put your bell peppers with two tablespoons of the cashew cheese you're gonna mix that really well and I'm also adding a little bit of Bragg's liquid aminos or you can use tamari as well if you want then to make our tamales you take a tamale sheet you put around one to two tablespoons of the rice then some bell peppers with the cheese and then you fold it the same as the other one so you fold it to the right or to the left then to the front and then you tie it at the top. You can add a little bit of rosemary and just make as many as you want and make them as big or small as you desire as well. So now to cook our tamales, for the corn tamales, we're gonna steam them. And you're gonna let them steam for around 30 to 40 minutes, depending on how it goes. You can check them, open them, see how they're doing. And for the rice tamales, put them in a pot with boiling water and let them cook the same. These ones are gonna take maybe a little bit longer, so maybe 40 to 60 minutes. And now we just wait to try them. <laughs> now the moment has come, and first I'm gonna try the corn ones. Mm, 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 mm. Honestly, you guys, they're so, so good. The chiles are kind of spicy. The corn is sweet, and it's just a perfect combination. And the texture is amazing. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. Now let's try the rice ones. Honestly, they're really, really good. 
Mm-hmm. One thing I do want to say is that if you're using brown rice, it's not going to stick as well. You're going to need more cashew cheese. But if you use white rice, then it's going to bind easier. Okay? They both taste super different, but they're delicious. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope that you guys try this recipe. If you guys try it, please use the hashtag Ravana recipe or hashtag Ravana on Instagram or Twitter so that I can see it and I get like it. I get so, so excited when I see you guys make my recipes. Don't forget to subscribe to my website, ravana.com, for my new upcoming ebook in about two or three weeks, January 2017. Stay tuned for that and subscribe here to my channel. Love you guys, sending you lots of love and light, a huge hug. Merry, merry, merry Christmas and I'll see you next week, okay? Bye.